Nobody knows why. Maybe. Bhaktapur Dattatrayi Square. What is Bhaktapur Durbar Square? Today, Bhaktapur Durbar Square is part of the UNESCO World Heritage Site known as Kathmandu Valley. Bhaktapur, which translates from Nepali to mean city of devotees, is situated in central Nepal, in the eastern part of the Kathmandu Valley. Details Dattatreya Square in Bhaktapur is the oldest square in the city. Well known for its three-storied temple of Hindu god Dattatreya that was built in 1427 by King Yakshamala. <laughs> About Dattatreya Square. Dattatreya Square is located to the east of Bhaktapur Durbar Square and Tumadi Square and is often called Takapal Toll. Dattatreya Square is also the oldest of all the squares in Bhaktapur. What are the famous plazas in Bhaktapur? Bhaktapur Durbar Square actually consists of several separate plazas, including Durbar Square, Tamedi Square, Dattatrayi Square, and the Pottery Square. This series of squares forms the heart of the city, which is evident in the fact that many of Bhaktapur's small streets converge on it. What is the significance of Dattatraya Square? Dattatraya Square is often referred to as Dattatraya Toll which is because Toll means market street area in Nepali. The area still has some old market stalls that are now corner stores. The square has an open central area with two main temples along with a smaller one, which is the oldest temple in Bhaktapur. To the east of the Durbar Square is Duttatrayi Square which is famous for its Duttatrayi Temple. This temple was established in 1427, uh, during the reign of Yakshamala, and is considered to be one of the oldest temples in Bhaktapur. What is the significance of the Bhaktapur Durbar Square? Bhaktapur Durbar Square in general is a collection of various major and minor temples and paddies built during the reign of different Mala kings. What makes Bhaktapur's Pottery Square so special? No place in Bhaktapur is void of temples. The Pottery Square is no exception. This square houses two different temples. The Jeth Ganesh Temple dates back to the year 1646. Unlike other temples around the place, this temple was not built by any kings or princes. Instead, this temple was donated by a wealthy man. Dattatrayi Square is another open museum that contains innumerable monumental masterpieces of wood carvings. A 15 minutes casual walk northeast of the Tamari Square, follow the winding brick road through the city's main bazaar, a fascinating walk past tiny shops selling sweets, clothes, brass, toys, and fruits is to couple toll. The route passes various water taps, ancient water tanks, and temples, most of them neighborhood shrines dedicated to Ganesh, the god of luck. Like the other squares, Duttatrayi Square is another open museum that contains innumerable monumental masterpieces of wood carvings. Duttatrayi Square takes its name from the Duttatrayi Temple. The square is originally known as Takapal verbally meaning the Grand Rest House. It is famous for ornate monasteries known as Mats. It is another large square which marks the old center of town. More notably, though, Takapal conceals Nepal's most celebrated masterpiece of wood carving museum. It is linked by richly decorated mat, nine in total, the densest concentration of these Hindu monasteries in the valley. Formerly they housed religious communities of ascetics and yogis, but descendants of the original inhabitants took them over long ago as private residences. Several of Takapal old mat have been converted into handicraft shops and one into a restaurant. Yeah. 
them but sometimes when you take the pictures very closely they may have some expectations of a small Well, this is a unique kind of therapy which is largely being used in the places like Tibet and Nepal. There are a lot of people, they are using the singing bowls which you can have on your back for the back act problems. Then in the meantime, they can get you that wearing like a helmet which is to keep yourself away from the stress and anxieties. And then they can get you over your, you know, like, say like, chest for the 
cholesterol, the heart block its problem and they can get it down to the knees for the knee problems. So sometimes they can let you stand inside the singing bowl and then this guy who is doing a therapy can make a sound doing like a ding dong from the four sides. And the right way, get and the then reaction. the sound ends with the OM. So this is okay. a procedure of healing therapies. Now look at there, he is now doing over your head and you can feel it. You have to be very focused. So this is for stress and anxiety.